every <sighs> let me let me change this up so this is gonna be a bit of a different video um, as you guys know I'm a filmmaker photographer I guess podcast host now uh, but I you know I've been making videos on my own channel since I've done that like relaunch thing in October about weekly as well as making videos for Android police almost weekly and by the way Android, working for Android police has been absolutely insane just because not insane in a bad way like insane in a really good way the reason is I you know have been following Android police way before I ever started making videos doing YouTube and so being able to actually work for them and you know make videos with these creators that I've also been watching for a really long time and be a part of that is just blows my mind and so I've really enjoyed that and you know plan to keep on doing that for a long time but uh, you know I've been making videos on my own channel Android police almost weekly weekly for mine almost weekly for Android police I've also been doing a bit of a podcast trying to do that weekly although I missed a week because I was out of town so there's that uh, I've also been doing Instagram almost daily, and that's been a lot of fun. But I feel like there is something that I need to change. Something that's been kind of weighing on me creatively and something that's just been bothering me. I don't like my videos. Now, of course, you know, I think they're fine and all that, but there's an issue with them. And that's when I have a deadline like weekly and when I'm also making videos for Android Police, which that's kind of my main priority just because, you know, making money there. Um, but when I have a deadline, you know, like every week, so Saturday morning, I want that video to go live, you know, that sets a time restriction, obviously. And, you know, I'll have shot the A-roll, I've edited it, it's all good. You know, I've shot the B-roll and I'm putting it in Friday night. And I realize I missed one shot. And so I have to go and reshoot it. But since it's Friday night, and I'm not gonna get daylight until after like my normal upload time, which is 8 a.m. my time, Arizona time. I can't get that shot with normal daylight. So I'll just quickly shoot that shot really like, ugh, not, not a great shot, but I'll just throw it in there, call it quits and, you know, release that video. I really don't like doing that. I like to consider myself as a cinematographer, someone who focuses on the quality, production value, lighting, composition, you know, motion with the camera, that sort of thing. But I feel like limiting myself to uh, spend such a short amount of time on these videos doesn't let me really spend the time to, you know, shot list things or plan things out very well. It's just like, let's get this done and get it out. And that's not really what I want to do. Yes, uploading weekly onto YouTube is definitely going to help me with growth. But that's not really what I care about right now. I really want to more focus on my cinematography than just sheer numbers. And obviously, there's a bit of a balance here. If you make lots of videos very quickly, you're going to learn how to edit faster, shoot faster, and just be more efficient. And that's been great. I've learned a lot from the past month. Um, but, you know, the flip side of that, of being able to spend a lot of time on a video, I feel like that could be super beneficial too. So that's what I'm doing this month. I'm not really going to give myself deadlines for these videos. I'm going to try to do two videos this month, max, but the, it may just be one video. It really depends on how happy I am with the videos and if I feel like they're ready for release and then I'll just publish them. Right now, I want to focus more on my own personal growth as far as you know, cinematography and photography. I really want to focus on that and then maybe later focus on growing on YouTube and all that sort of thing. So I'm doing kind of a bit of experiment with this. I'm going to see how it goes. Uh, Cody Warner, he's this daily vlogger, and I want to call him a motivational speaker because whenever I watch his videos, I get so excited to go and shoot a new video or edit this video or just get it published and like, not in the bad way of like rushing it, but like, you know, just get stuff done. He's super motivating. So by the way, Cody, if you're watching this, thank you for the energy. Um, but yeah, definitely check him out. Links wherever. Anyway, he has this movement called No Small Creator. And the idea behind that is that the concept and the action of creating a video and making things is so much bigger than just like sheer numbers of like how many views you get or how many subscribers you get that, um, you know, there's really no small creator. Everyone who's making videos is just as valuable, just as important as someone who's making, you know, videos, but also, you know, millions and millions of subscribers or whatever. It just that doesn't really matter in the grand scheme of things. But as a bit of a play on words to that, he's started a bit of a hashtag, a bit of a challenge called No Small November. Typically for him, 
you know, November is kind of slow, things don't really get done, and it's just kind of a bleh month. And so he wanted to kind of flip that and really hammer hard on November. The idea is that you have one project that you commit to working on and getting completed in the month of November, and then every week you publish three videos uh, kind of documenting that process. And so I've decided to do that. This is kind of the first step, the first phase of those videos. Obviously, this is kind of the weekend, so I'm not doing three videos in one day or whatever. But um, I'm going to be doing three videos documenting kind of like my filmmaking process, my thoughts, and I'm going to be doing that on Instagram. And I'll be doing those as Instagram stories, kind of similar to how Jesse Driftwood does his very fancy vlogs that I really, really enjoy also. But yeah, I'm going to be doing that. It's a little bit weird for me to be stepping back like this and, you know, slowing down on my own channel. I mean, I'm not really going to slow down on Android Police because I feel like I've gotten a good rhythm there. But as far as my own channel, you know, slowing down, I feel like it's going to be interesting. So I'm really excited to see, you know, what can come out of this, the type of videos that I'll be able to make, giving myself more time. So I'd love it if you would kind of join me on this adventure experiment thing. Uh, Instagram handle link thing is in the description. So if you want to follow me there, that would be awesome. Well, that's it. Thanks so much for watching. If you like this video, hit that thumbs up button. If you like cinematic tech videos, go ahead and hit that subscribe button and pop that bell. Um, and yeah, let me know what you think about my experiment down in the comments below. Thanks. See you later.